Hello folks, it is I, the one, the only Hobo Tom. What's, what, what are these things? It's a button? Oh, wait a second. It's not an American flag on a sale. And is this not the greatest undershirt ever? Yes, you know what that means. I want every red-blooded American to have a delicious lemonade because that runs like water through our great country. As well as what our scientists and mixologists have created. Probably the most refreshing drink in all of summer. Again, and Amer only in America can you get watermelon flavored whiskey. America. So I want every American stand up. Gentlemen, take off your hats. Put your right hand over your heart and stand as we play, or as I play, the greatest national anthem on planet Earth. Yes, it is that time again in the Daytona Beach Bum Fight League where both the watermelon whiskey and delicious lemonade flow like water here, especially in Florida because it's hot. Yes, it's a little special. Yeah, and from the Daytona Beach Bum Fight League, we have, as you saw as the picture indicated, it's back to our roots, back to the revolution. You have people from the Daytona Beach Bum Fight League taking on, in some form or fashion, those that represent the kingdom of Greater Britannia and its commonwealth. Because, well, there are no great British tag teams because the version of... WWE 2K Sports I have doesn't have the Dynamite Kid. But yes. And the other thing, a lot of British wrestlers come from Manchester upon time. Indeed. And at the very end of the show, fireworks for again, what is American? It's like delicious, cold, frosty, semi-carbonated. The important part. Ah, lemonade, the scientific genius behind putting watermelon, which is rich in electrolytes and delicious, into premium whiskey. Fireworks! And of course later, I'll be having some gourmet hot dogs. I'm going to have them with. I'm going to have it kind of Chicago style. I don't have the poppy seed buns. I have the pickle, the tomato. I 
forget what style hot dog that is. It's pickled tomato. And I'm going to put Dijon mustard and cheese on it. America! Again. If you're going to be out there, be safe. Come home with all ten fingers. Or like at least seven. Yeah. Having seven fingers, I guess you could make things work a little bit. Yeah, be safe. Um, don't hit hobos. That's that's, that's bad. Because I might have to go hoboing tomorrow. And yeah, I have to dodge fireworks. And So yeah, don't drink and drive. If you're going to enjoy the scientifically created mixology drink of watermelon whiskey, do so in the pleasure of your own home and just chill out, enjoy your neighbor's fireworks display, let them blow their fingers off. Yeah, that sounds better. But again, I'd like to wish everyone a happy 4th of July. Please enjoy the wrestling show and the fireworks that will follow the wrestling show. Wow, the Daytona Beach Bone Fight League is getting more money. Can afford fireworks. That's a good thing. Other than that, I'd like to thank everyone for watching. Please enjoy and have a happy, fun, and safe 4th of July. Hello, folks. Welcome to another edition. A special edition. Oh, who's this? Prime. Lex Luger. Wait a second. You know what that means. Yep, it's that special day again where Americans celebrate their independence or as those people across the, across the pond say, celebrate the revolution. But yes, it's the July 4th special edition of the Daytona Beach Bump Fight League Wrestling here in, 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 in Daytona Beach. I, I'd say beautiful, but not really. Yep, here we have classic, the man who defeated Yokozuna. On the bridge of the USS Independence, Lex Luger. Of course, because this is the opening match, we have to have a corporate sponsorship. And the man who tells everyone to get back to work. We have the Undertaker. The man who wants everyone to get back to work on the fourth of July. We don't have to work. Yeah, it's kind of long, but it's like telling everyone to get back to work. Be, be more wholesome here in, in Daytona Beach. Uh, okay, that's gonna work. This is awesome. I don't know why all these people are so fully clothed. Like, they have to have like, some beach blanket windows here. There's a beautiful ocean in the background. You can tell it's kind of angry looking. The police APC in the background. The, the shark tower there. Because, well, the New Smyrna Beach have a bunch of shark towers. That's a shark capital of, like, Florida. Or the U.S., I think. Yeah, a little opening day, 4th of July match. Here at the Daytona... Oh, Lex Luger! Anything traditional. No, Lex this is a power driver. This kicks him in the gut. That's how you impress the WWE universe, folks. Wow, Lex. Again, he is a little bit older. He's going to be slow, methodical, take his time. There can only be one top dog we, here in the WWE. Here and, there. and a win here will go a long stomp. way in solidifying one of these guys' claims of being the best in the business. What has to be going through the mind of Lex Luger right now? Look at Lex Luger making his move. I'll be shocked if that's not it. Rolling out of the ring, and after what we just saw, I can't believe he can still stand. Yeah, that was vicious. Dodges to the side of that one. Lex Luger's time at WWE during the 1990s remains one of the most talked about runs in sports entertainment history. Remember, he came in following a very successful reign as WCW champion and then went on to become an American hero after slamming the mighty Yokozuna on the deck of the Intrepid on July 4th, 1993. Oh, Intrepid, not, not the Independence. I'm sorry. 
Who's well, second to start with the night? Oh. He's docking his opponent from the top. To hey, here we go with the under. Ouch. Something he's that he was not known for. It goes to the top rope. That was weird. Uh oh. Lex is like huge. That's it. He's oh, did Lex get busted open? On his heels. But it's going to take a lot more than that to stop him here tonight. But you know what? Oh, no bench. matter the format or competitors involved, you know we're in for a great one here. This might be it. Quickly getting back to the summer of 1995. Oh, we found a move by Lex Luger. The torture rack.
the match of the night. Well, regardless, we're underway and rolling on another great WWE event. Oh, such great chain wrestling here. Looking for the win. Very British style wrestling. It's all academic from here. He's starting to feel it here. This tag team match can get out of hand quickly if he does quick man. Hey, is this in a kick out? Ah, uh, the kick out's all that's saving. This match goes on. That's actually a pretty good wrestling match. These competitors will always be looking at their finishing maneuver, and when that happens, the complexion of the match can change in a heartbeat. You're right about that. There's no coming back from that. Yes, you can do it, baby. And it's up. He got the shoulder up. What do you have to do to keep this guy down? It's going to take more than that to keep him down tonight. Look at him over there, begging for the tag. Oh, look how badly he wants the tag. Nobody home there. Nobody home? Oh, that looks like the house has been empty for months. The whole bone breaker! The whole bone breaker! The whole bone breaker! Explosion of offense come from. Going for it all here. <laughs> Thanks for coming. And he kicks out. And he lives to fight again. After the amount of punishment he suffered, it's simply amazing that he's still in this. Big one. European uppercut. I like that. Oh, he missed. Oh, oh, nobody hold that time. Oh. The tag is made. fails to connect with anything that time. Man, that was some miss, all right. I can feel the breeze all the way over here. Oh, this has actually been a good wrestling match. Classic pro wrestling. Oh, my gosh! Mm -hmm. And he brings the action back inside the ring. Yeah. This is good strategy, but he was successful outside. Oh, guillotine leg drop. Hey, Aiden, Aiden English has been in here for a while. Or, or Aiden Austin, what am I saying? Inside the ring again. Yeah, and they stuck. should be. This is where the action needs to be. He's got him. This is not good. He's moving like a man possessed. And he finally gets out of the ring. Oh, looking to make a statement here. Oh, no, this is not good. That's it. He's done. Oh, the Brit Swan. The Brit Swan. That's not good. That was a good match. Though. And here's just some of the action we saw during the match. They really isolated Aiden English. Uh oh, what's, what's going to happen now? Yep, those two guys. Decisive. Two boys from across the pond. Well, if you didn't Good show. Look at no that. Reason no rally for now. rally. Not after that performance. What a way to end and this bumps time. looks young. That's actually pretty cool. No kidding. I hate that it's over. Just, it's a ladder match. How is that? Is there a helicopter pulling that belt up? Oh, no. So many athletes for the belts.
being suspended, but maybe it's like some X. Oh, that's a good shot there. Oh, 
Is that a ladder set up? Oh no, is he gonna set him through the ladder? Oh, 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 he broke Neville, he broke the ladder, he might have broken himself. Something crazy that's going on. defensive here. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral. Oh, it's just here. a very, very no thing. We say outside the ring. It doesn't matter as much as what happens inside that ring. We're looking at complete domination here. Good Lord, that wasn't even close. So that's what it's like being so far off the mark. This is actually a good match. That wild strike found nothing but empty air that time. <laughs> uh -oh. Man, that's what you call swinging for the fences and missing. Now back to the ring. Back to the ring. Outside the ring. In, out. This match is everywhere. Man, he's still down after that move. I almost wonder if his bell got seriously wrong there. Nice snap souffle. Good lord, that wasn't even close. Oh, that's what it's that's like being so far scary. off the mark. Oh, some boost to the face. He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. Are we going to see it? The Poison Rana. Oh my goodness, is that the setup? More boots to the head. Uh oh, oh no. Get up, come on. I'm having a hard time figuring out what they're going to do next. Me too, I've given up even trying to break down here. And he touches that one. This match 
Watts is giving me flashbacks of Shawn Michaels and Razor Ramon vying for the Intercontinental Championship in the historic WrestleMania 10 ladder match. Go to it! Oh my god! Oh my god! Wow, that was a wild strike. Talk about missing the target. Yeah, it looked like it was completely out of desperation. Oh my god. <laughs> He's done. So many ladders. Oh, come on, don't do it again. How slow he is to recover here. That was some serious incoming. Oh! The moose off the ladder. And he noticed all it. Good lord, that wasn't even close. Oh my goodness. Like this is amazing. Far. This is awesome. Fight forever. Oh no. Inside the ring. And that's oh, why he's no. such a great athlete. Such an important superstar. She's awfully pasty looking white to be here in Florida, but that's a whole other issue. I 
do make good looking belts though. I'll give you that much. My design is status. There's the belt. And here we go. Oh, out of nowhere. In a Duval County street fight. Oh, that would have been good. That's all that matters. Off going to the top. High risk. Not off the top. I wouldn't know what that's like. She's gonna be able to stand after that. Skull crusher. What are your thoughts on Paige? It might be a while before she finds her footing now. It's an amazing atmosphere in this arena tonight. Oh, you're right. Big fight field. Oh, oh, what a shot with a guitar. I mean, that thing exploded. Michael, here's something that'll blow your mind. The first time Paige was actually in the ring for a professional match. Oh, my, what a move. Oh, you know what this means. She's having a real hard time getting back to her feet. Good Lord, that wasn't even close. So that's what it's like being so far off the mark. Look at this. Could it be? It's got to be over now. That's the one thing about the new AW Fight Forever game, is at least the one you will do. Talk about a direct hit. Yeah, come on. Pick it up, pick it up. Ow! Bonk. Yeah, oh, what a shot with the guitar! I mean, that thing exploded! Check her out. Look at her here. She set it on fire. She set it on fire. Oh, no. This can't end well, Cole. It's on fire. She just set it on fire. Oh, we've got a situation on our hands now, guys. Joke. Yeah. yeah, flaming table spot, yeah, baby. To Back to the ring, outside the ring, in, out. This match is everywhere. Look at Paige making. Here we go. Here it is. The spot heard around the world. The flaming table spot. So we set it up right. We'll find out. Oh. Oh, oh, Paige goes right through the flaming table. Both of these competitors have so much resolve, it's going to take a minor miracle to keep one of them down. Oh, I haven't seen Destino in a while. We're looking at complete domination here. arena the WWE Universe hanging on every move. You're right, Paul. It's electric here. The WWE Universe is loving this match. Ooh, a little showboating going on here. We're looking at complete domination here. Hey, where's Sestino?
That was a decent match. I forgot who this. I forgot how to do this too. I'm done that for so long. video editing. He's on 
the defensive here. He needs to create some space and find a way to get back on the offensive. Regardless, mm -hmm. people will look back on this night and tell stories to their grandkids about it. Let's take a moment to talk about the challenger. And here comes the question, do you want to quit? Dodges to the side of that one. JK is so good at re reversals. Narrowly avoids the attack there. USA! USA! Oh wait, what's, 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 what's he doing? In great condition here, looks like there's only been a bit of damage dished out thus far. Whoa, whoa! Oh, no, I asked him, Ralph. No coverage in this matchup. You need to force your opponent to say, I quit. And that's what's happening here. No! Still lots of fight left. Oh, JT Rocks. Ask him that. I don't even care. The officials in close here are checking on him. Trying to get under his opponent's skin with this one. He says no, but he thought about it. He thought about it there. Oh, but there's still plenty in the tank. Uh oh. Kyle driven through the table. He said it. I don't get it. It's keeps the boss. What a win. Awesome. Jay Rocks. Jay Tay Rocks. Jay Tay Rocks. Pretty good. That was a good match. That was fun at least. Look at the way he lifts that belt. He loves that belt more than life. He loves that belt more than doing the whole effing show. Whoa, I think he just put the entire WWE roster on notice with that victory. Folks, we just saw one of the most exciting matches you'll see anywhere. Commonwealth 
of Calgary, Alberta, Canada. Mr. Nasty himself. Well, they're, they're coming out separately. Now it's the Heart Foundation. That's a weird thing. Again, towards the end, like, Jimmy and I are, did have his issues. But still, they're like brothers in laws. Florida education system obviously failed for it. Although I'm still surprised those soccer balls are still in use as turnbuckle posts. Well, Jim the Anvil Neidhart, Brett the Hitman Hart, the Hart Foundation. You know, so not seeing eye to eye for whatever reason, but that was weird. The presentation. The Mustard Yellow Intercontinental Lucha Libre Tag Team Champions of the World. Oh, the roof off this place. What an incredible tag team match this is going to be. Yeah, all signs point to this match being one for the ages. I want to point out, it's important to mesh with your partner in a tag match. You don't necessarily have to like them, but if you're not on the same page, you're probably going to lose. Well, I don't know about you guys, but with a champion the hobo choke. The hobo choke. His partner's being punished and he's seen it up. Getting your pass with Brett Hitman Hart is certainly tumultuous at best. Remove yourself from that if you can for a moment and talk to us about the excellence of execution. That wild strike found nothing but empty air then. Looks like another check in the wind column. Good lord, that wasn't even close. So that's what it's like being so far off the mark. He's trying to choke the life. This has to be it. He's seen it up. Here he comes. Trying to choke the life that out of Fred Hart. Got nothing but empty air that time. <laughs> Man, that's what you call swinging for the fences and missing.
the championship at stake. You know these Thanks superstars sure. will get everything they have to win here tonight. Oh, that goes without saying, Cole. The WWE Championship, it's what it's all about here in the WWE. Every sport reversal. Interesting. Well, again, folks, thank you for watching. Please enjoy the fireworks after this amazing show. I'd like to thank everyone for watching. And if you're setting off fireworks, be safe. Like, leave home with at least, leave wherever you are dealing with at least seven fingers. Yeah, that, that would be preferably ten, but, but as long as you have seven on two hands, you should be okay. Yeah, I'd like to thank everyone for watching. Happy 4th of July, everyone. Bye. And remember, stay tuned for fireworks.